and I honestly think a lot of adults uh, in their late 20s, early 30s would get a kick out of this game because it kind of brings you back to your roots a little bit, but with a modern day twist. And I think that um, I think the demographic for this game is is a lot wider than than most. All right, so this is uh, Crossing Souls. When did this come out? Just the other day. Yeah, we uh, we played it at PSX. Um, currently, we're playing this not on the PlayStation. Yeah, we did play it at PSX. Yeah. No, this is on PC. They said they were releasing it on PC, but it's PlayStation, PlayStation and Switch, but it's not out for the Switch. Everything always seems to come to the Switch later. Um, but yeah, this one, this is the one that I think out of all the games of PSX, I that wasn't it. Guacamelee, this was the biggest surprise, because it's so... So it was Adventure Pals. Though we too. played a lot of good games, actually. We actually did, yeah. And none of them were, like, first-party Sony games. No, like, they were all, all the, awesome. Yeah, it was... Uh, this one, though, I, I am waiting for the Switch, because it's totally the game I want to play, That's, like, yeah. portable. Exactly. Um, but God, I love the aesthetic here. Like, I love the detail here with, like, the Ghostbusters and the little Pac-Man ghost over there. The NES... Yeah, it's cool that they did such a good do- job being able to, like, display that. Like, you can tell that's a Nintendo. Yeah. Uh, what was it he mentioned, like, they started working on this game right before Stranger Things. Yeah, hit. I was t- talking and to Jenna about that. He's yeah. like, he was like, oh, you know, it's, people are going to say that we're ripping off that aesthetic, but it kind of just works out for them, because that's what's in right now. Um, yeah. This game is so pretty. Whoa. It's weird playing. <laughs> so he can jump. I'm trying to remember what they all can do. He, he covered a lot of ground. Yeah, he's like the probably say bye to my He's like the all-around kind of fighter. The brother farts. The girl is like speed dash tags. I thought she had a... She has a whip? Yeah. Um, the... The African American gentleman uh, he is just turns a, into a Super a Saiyan and stops. Yeah, he's like the tank. The nerdy guy can he can float or something like that. He has like rocket like boots rocket or some shoes shit. or something. Yeah, but I'm this guy. Not guy's, reading any of this. No, it's not. We don't need it. We already know what <laughs> we we literally played this anyways. No, I know, yeah. but for fans. In a way, for if this was like fans, a, I have more fans than Nick. Fans. If this is like an adventure game, that guy is essentially like the warrior class. He's like the guy from, uh, what's it called? Got that pompadour. What was that movie? The baseball movie? Sandlot? Sandlot. He's like the Oh yeah, no, he's he's definitely. I love the idea of this game that it's like your big summer adventure but you have to protect your little brother who's kind of useless. Like... Wait, what the fuck? It would help if you like faced the baseballs. There There you go. No, if if you faced him. Am I supposed... Where am I supposed to hit? Just hit him. There you go. It's a tutorial. Great, hey, son. son. You're so good. <laughs> You're so good. You missed almost all of those. Cool. All right. Well, thanks, Dad. Dude. Dude, mom Did is taking. Know- Look at mom's picture really quick. Man, Holy crap. She's guys. taking some Xanax. That's for sure. Have you? Did you know that the lady from the Cranberries died? Really? The singer. Which song did the Cranberries have? Zombie. Uh, yeah. Yes. In your head. Yeah, that's the song. Zombie. Zombie. Yeah, that sucks. What'd she die from? Zombies. <laughs> Why did I even ask that? I have no idea, dude. She died from zombies. Can you imagine if she actually was killed by zombies? <laughs> <laughs> it's like... Uh, holy shit. Dude, I've been listening to so... Like, at... Because I'm such a fucking garbage millennial. I've been listening to so many 90s playlists on, like, Pandora and... Google Play. They, they have some good ones on uh, dude, I, Spotify. Yeah, I don't want to use Spotify anymore. Uh, either, actually. Dude, I forgot how good 90s alternative rock was. Uh, Is this <laughs> yeah. Is this really good? I think so. I don't know. Dude, I was, no joke, asleep when we were testing out this game. I was so tired. Dude, I, I, I got like three hours of sleep as usual for these events. You uh, and I both do that. We both sleep for two minutes before we're going <laughs> to go spend a 12-hour day interviewing Fucking people. walking 20 miles. And yeah, dude, I remember playing this game, literally closing my eyes and waking up being like, oh, I'm in another world. <laughs> this game is cool. 
Okay. God, it's so pretty. Um, that's so weird. But yeah, I love that we're talking about the 90s with this 80s game, but yeah, I don't know, dude. 90s alternative rock is just like, it's just so good. I mean, I like Third Eye Yeah. There's a lot of really good singles. I, well, what started it is that I, so I've told you many times, my uncle is like a weird deadhead, but he's like the Dave Matthews Band version of that, which is bizarre. Um, and I've been trying to listen to Dave Matthews because I'm like, what's the appeal? Dude, their band is so good. I don't, but they have no song. Yeah, be the other guy. Yeah, I don't. Um, oh no, climb up the climb up the thing. I don't like their songs, but their band. Oh yeah, no, no. Musically, they are they're amazing. Very good. Um. It is funny that they're like this, like yuppie, deadhead sort of thing. Like Monocle's very much this, like they're like fish. Guy. It's like the same. Well, yeah, but fish. it's but it's like you hear. I hear my uncle talk about. It, he's like, yeah, you know, we're taking our uh, eighty thousand dollar RV out to to follow Dave Matthews Band for six oh, months. He like, the money. Oh my god. No, but it's it's. I don't know. It's weird. Uh, no, dude. <laughs> hey. For the record... Hey, you're playing video games like a real game journalist. I know this, really isn't, shitty. this isn't hard, but I will say this reminds me a lot of the, of that guy that couldn't figure out the Cuphead tutorial. <laughs> That's what I was about to say. You're just doing things right. Did you ever see that where they compared... Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. 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 Wow. Oh, my God. I can't believe I Did got that. Did you ever that. see that some dude uh, put the Cuphead tutorial video next to a video of a bird figuring out how to solve like a puzzle? <laughs> and the bird... <laughs> <laughs> this bird solves a puzzle before him. Dude, monkeys have figured out that they can, like, take straws and put them over fences and shit uh-huh. to get water. And this guy couldn't figure it out to double tap A. I don't know what. Granted, I mean, our Hunt Showdown video. Dude, I've never played... <laughs> that's, that's like, muscle memory. Like, yeah. when I'm doing this right now, I don't have to think. Yeah. And, uh... Uh, I and think we're trust getting me. Kobe Bryant up here. So. Dude, God, he's so racist. <laughs> trust me, I uh, I'm fully aware of my keyboard capabilities. But the the other day I was playing Black Ops Three and I put on the the Giant, which is the Darius remake from uh-huh. from World of War. And uh, I played up to like round fifteen with a mouse and keyboard because mm-hmm. I was like I just I need to I need to practice. But it. it the, I think my favorite Switch? part about playing on PC... Um, I think you have to blast it with your gunner, yeah. Uh, my favorite part about playing on PC is changing the field of view. I oh, love yeah. that. I wish they had that on other systems. Why? Some, So some games have that option. Nothing um, that I've ever I feel played. like every shooter at this point should, because there's somewhere it's so goddamn close and I get sick. Like, I like having a nice wide field of view. I know, it's, it's amazing. The only thing I don't like about it is, um, so if you're looking straight, things are far yeah, or whatever, yeah. but then there's like this magnified look on yeah, the edges, it's, it's on your a, peripheral. Well, it's it's like, you know like when you it. look at like a GoPro? It looks exactly, yeah, yeah it's, it's just that. That's just how they do it's it. It's just and, that. You know, uh, but I don't like that necessarily for gaming because then you'll look on your right and there'll be something that looks like it's up close and then you yeah you put your your normal view on it and then it's like far as hell away mm-hmm. so it just took me a little bit to get used to but whatever Lakers so we're I mean, clearly yeah. not talking about this game anymore I, well, okay well big Joe Carter we don't uh, really need to talk about it this can be like a pod, yeah like a podcast. we've we've also I mean we have like a more in-depth discussion right after we played it but and we'll put we'll put the yeah. link for the the real video. You gotta finish what you started. Move the you gotta move that shit over to the fruit. There you go. Gotta show how strong it is. Oh, I actually. Wait, we didn't get the last character, did we? Oh no, that last character. The last character's the, the girl. The, no, move the it over to the right. The brother. Oh yeah, yeah, it's the little brother. Yeah. Oh shit. shit. I like, not to sound lame or anything. I think this game does diversity pretty well you know it does it in a way where I don't feel like it's forced it's not like I like looking at when all five kids are there that I, does look like a, a group of kids you would see in a neighborhood exactly like it's like the black kid who looks like he's in the basketball has the cool hair 
the like this guy's obviously the leader kid. And he's gonna be you know, shit. but he's got like the nerdy friend who it's like yeah, <laughs> who are they fighting Prince? Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's, that's what guy? we said. What, we said that that same joke last time. Well, <laughs> we didn't say that on camera. Pretty sure we did. Actually. Are you fighting the revolution right now? Um, actually, <laughs> I, I think it's funny that you talk about forced diversity, diversity because do you? Watch the show The Path. Do you know what The Path is? No. The Path. Is it too forced? I think. The Path is a show about. Dude, you would love it. It's so good. It has uh, Aaron Paul from Breaking Bad. Oh, 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 the Hulu one. Yeah, don't tell me about it because I actually do want to watch that. Okay. Yeah. Well, you'll see the forced diversity in the third season. Okay. I don't uh, know why they decided to do it. It made yeah. no sense. They. I'm not. I don't care if people. Yeah, that's a thing. Like, I'm not saying it's bad. Like, but when but they're doing it just to be a, a social justice warrior, it's stupid. When it's when it feels like you're just checking a box, it's probably that's, a better way to say that's like, that's what they're doing. Yeah, this game definitely mm -hmm. isn't because those. When you see all the kids together, like it really does seem like you could go to Middle America and you would find these four kids in a park throwing rocks at something because it's like, oh yeah, that would be like me growing up. My friends like we weren't all just. We didn't all look the same. Yeah. But it was just like, oh, my parents live near your parents, so we're going to be gonna friends. We're going to be friends, yeah. And friends with like, pretty much anybody. Yeah, and it's like, I like that. I hate when it's like, got to have this one box checked in this one. Yeah. And yeah. Then, then they always seem to be stereotypes, too. It's like the Native American kids, like, oh, dude, I hated this part. It's a tutorial bullshit. You have to, like, dodge, I think. No, uh, there was a... Why do you just have to, like, fuck this kid up? Oh, wow. Okay. So my, uh, Siri on my watch just read our last conversation. I'll dictate it right now. This is what my watch just picked up. Aaron Paul tomorrow. Okay, why they decided to do it. I'm not... I don't care <laughs> of people not saying it's bad when it's what it feels like you're just checking box because... There really does seem like you could go to mid-America and you would find this for kids and it parks on the rocks something because, like, that would be my friends. Like, we were all just reading all the same. My parents would know your parents. Yeah, it's like I like I hate when it's like, who me? What the hell is going so on? So that's, that's on an beat, Apple server somewhere. How did you beat this? Switch, uh, charge it? Yeah. Hold it? There you go. About Damn, you getting fucked up. Cool. Well, at least when you die, you'll come back and he'll tell you what to do. You're too busy thinking about Aaron Paul to... Yeah. Oh, there you go. Wait yeah. for him to get tired and then, um... And then do that thing. Yeah, then shoot him with your... With... Well, you gotta hit... I mean, you're a child literally fighting a hillbilly kid with a literal laser gun right now. And none of these people are, like, amazed. <sighs> wow, that was close. That exhausted arc. All these Swedish people put all this. Alright, so this one you have to dodge roll. Damn, did you beat the. These are like the shittiest parents ever. In your head. <laughs> they literally just. In your head. Do you think these kids have to do this every time they want to hang out with that girl? Probably. Damn, almost. He has a dodge roll. Whatever. Yeah, but it doesn't. I tried it. Gotta go super save for the next one. The true fight. Isn't the isn't it the big big Joe guy? There we go. The true fight here. He just straight up fights. <laughs> he just oh shit. Jesus, it's like two hits to kill him. Okay. Uh, I think you have a ground pound or something. I mean, I guess you just mow through everybody. I. This seemed way harder at PSX. I think they made it a little bit easier. I think it's because you were asleep. That might be it too. Cause there was, cause I died a lot. There was this. points where I would look at you and nothing would be moving on the screen. <laughs> and the guy was like, <laughs> luckily I was like talking to the guy for some reason. I think even though we were both really tired, we balanced our work. There. Yeah, cause then during the next game, I think you were falling asleep and I was like, all talking. Yeah. And that guy was like, let me talk about my burritos. Oh, that guy sucked. Yeah, that game was fucking. That game sucked. The sword of Ditto. Okay, how fast you did that there? 
that took me like 10 minutes at PSX because I literally think I kept falling asleep yeah. and not doing anything. Yeah, we were we were tired. Come on, honey. <laughs> see, see, like, see, like doing it. <laughs> Whoa, shit. Whoa. All right, well, I'm going All right, well. <laughs> How did your little brother get this far? Sorry about four. Ah, uh, yeah, yeah, blah, blah, blah. All right, cool. Mm -hmm. Great, uh huh? Cool, yeah. Why is this dude selling hot dogs in the the forest? In case you get hungry on your way in, bro. <laughs> I don't know, I, I think you gotta be a little suspect with the hot dogs in this song. Um, is he so, so far... Climb? Uh, so far, what do you think about this game? Uh, I think it's better than Call of Duty Wolf. <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's definitely a Destiny killer, that's for sure. Uh, no, I like it. I, it's fun, man. Yeah, it's it's definitely when it comes to the Switch, I'm absolutely gonna play the fuck out of it. I don't think it's going to. Everything's going to come to the Switch. You really think that this indie developer is gonna be like, oh, indie, all right, let's, yeah, it's Devolver. They're pretty big. They're gonna have to put. They're gonna have to port it. Do yeah, all but, this work. Dude, yeah, but right now the Switch is like printing money, so. I, I wish I was. Why would they not say it a release date for the Switch? Like, to sell it on everything else first. Because there's a lot of people like me that are gonna go, oh, I'll wait for the Switch. And then, like, oh, yeah. oh, and right. then there's stupid people like me that are still gonna be like, I, I need to buy this now, and then I'll buy it on the Switch later. I can't see. What? what nope. It's like golfing. Oh, nope. Okay. Hey. Oh, I didn't see that. Damn, that was a, that was a feat. In your mind. Um, in your mind. I, I don't know if it's because I'm getting older and like, it is. I'm not. Yeah, probably. And I'm not. I don't have as much time as I used to. But I really think I like indie games more than big temple releases. Unless it's like a game like God of War. I'm obviously going to put a lot of time into. I don't think I'm going to put a lot of time into it. Well, I mean, I'm going to definitely. When I say gonna, a lot of time, I mean I'm, I'm going to put the. I'm going to beat it. Twenty hour go upstairs. I, know, I just wanted to see. Yeah. I don't. You know, like, when you get to an area and you, like, you're explore. supposed to explore everything and find... Check like, every fucking trash can. Yeah, I don't think this is that good. Yeah. Uh... Got a little ahead of myself. Yeah, like... God of War, I'm definitely gonna put the time in to beat it, but... What about Far Cry 5? Absolutely. Do you think, I, do you I think we should get it on it. PC or PlayStation? Um... There's like multiplayer. Let's get it on Xbox. Xbox? Yeah. Okay. There was multiplayer on the last one, and I played it once with a guy, and it was like he got an uh, ultralight, and we just kind of went around fucking people up. I I hope it has stuff like Far Cry Four, where you know the secret ending of Far Cry Four. Achievement. Hell yeah, dude! I never played any Far Cry. Dude, Far Cry Four is the greatest good and like the best possible ending. The bad guy in the beginning says, hey, just uh, hold on for a second, I gotta deal with something. Enjoy the crab, because you're like eating together. If you stay there for 10 minutes, he'll walk back and a cutscene comes and goes, oh cool, you stayed, how was the crab? And then it cuts to this like really happy ending and then he just goes, all right, let's fuck shit up. And then it plays, uh, should I stay or should I go from the clash? This is the <laughs> ending? That's, that's the secret ending. The very first part of the game when you first get control if you don't leave the room you're in and, like, go on your dumb adventure and you do what a normal person would do, which is, like, well, I guess I'll eat this crab, uh, you... The guy... The bad guy comes back because he literally leaves the room saying, hey, I gotta deal with something. He comes back and he goes, oh, cool, you stayed. All right, well, let's go do what you came here for, which is to bury your mom's ashes. Oh, okay. And then he goes, hey, you want to ride in my helicopter and shoot at poor people? And then the game ends. Well, that's... Four? That's the happiest ending. Yeah, That's four. four. Well, I've four never, is cool I, I've never played a Far Cry series. Um, I'm excited. I want to do it. I like the idea of this. Like the graphics look, look cool. Yeah, you're fighting. Whoa, you're essentially fighting a cult in Montana, and you're like a cop. Oh, and, fuck. I don't know. Um, the only the only problem with all these shooters is they're all the fucking same. I want to play. Oh, yeah. 
Like, I wanted to get Ghost Recon Wildlands because it looks beautiful, but I don't want a game just because no. it looks fucking beautiful. Like, Far graphics Cry's... don't... Graphics are yeah. cool, but they don't matter. Far Cry is cool because it's the, like, Call of Duty sort of shooter, but then, like, oh, a bear's gonna fuck me up as I'm trying to, like, drive my shitty little motorcycle So around. it's that... Yeah, it has the survival kind of hook to okay. it. Okay. It's fun. Uh, <laughs> it has a lot to do with Crossing Souls. Jesus, look at Randall. Hold on. Yeah, Why dude. is everyone on, like... Okay, I know why these kids are all fighting each other. Because they're all on PCP. Dude, because they're on, like, a shitload of uh, Ritalin. And then this is the one summer they didn't get it because the recession hit or something. And then they all decided it's the 80s. And... Yeah, dude. I mean, you pretty much... That's, you nailed it. I don't know what else there is to say. I, I figured out. I cracked the code, Devolver. I really don't. I know he's supposed to fart and whatever, but is that it? Yeah. Remember what the the developer said? Like, the whole point of the little brother being useless is that it's like... He's like a useless little brother. Yeah. When you're little and it's like, oh, I have to take my brother with me out playing. Well, he's not going to contribute at all. Jesus. Look at that. But, like... That's the point. Is that it's supposed to feel like you're taking your little brother along with you? Yeah. It just sucks. Yeah. He's supposed to. Know. Yeah. Damn, dude. Do you think, like, the police would go? No, it's 80s. Yeah, there's no police. I love that in these movies, like... God, these cutscenes are so... Like, oh, there's a dead body. Let's go poke it. Like, wouldn't it smell bad? Probably, but they're outside. All right, they're just gonna leave the body there. Oh, do you think Chris and Charlie are banging? You know, I'm gonna reveal something with you right now. At PSX, I was so tired, I literally almost asked that. Yeah. I almost was like, hey, I got a question about the game. Are those two, like, a thing? Are those two slamming geni <laughs> genitals? Are they a thing? But like, I didn't want to... Don't put a crystal I, in a computer or something? Yeah, and then, like, ghosts or some shit come out. Oh, sorry, spoiler. So we it. didn't get past this. Yeah. Oh, Which well, is probably not, good. Not That's that probably a good point to stop So, the But video. then it's going to be the same video. No, we never did a video. Oh, so we just talked about it. Oh, yeah, there's no way they could have had Yeah, we talked video. about it in front of some... Uh, Oriental gentlemen that were posing in front of a car. So. That's true. <laughs> uh. Is everyone dancing? Uh, I think you gotta. There's something. Do gotta, something. Do something. Ah? Okay. How's this kid afford all this shit? I think they're in a secret lab. I don't think it's his. I love this animation, by the way. I know, it's so fucking beautiful. It just looks so... Like, God, Charlie's so hot. <laughs> He's like 12. They don't look like kids, though. Well, yeah, when they get through the animation, they all turn like 38, but... Yeah. <laughs> Uh-oh, cave people. So would you recommend this game? Uh, yeah. Yeah. I mean... Who would you, who would you actually, here's the better thing, because that's always such a dumb, you know, oh, is it worth your time, would you recommend it? Like, who, who would you recommend this to? Well. Well. Oh. Uh, that's <laughs> my uh, grade for school. I would recommend this game, um, I feel like, uh, I don't think kid, kids necessarily like children, but. Yeah, I think the kid that. Middle school and up, and I, and I honestly think a lot of adults uh, in their late 20s, early 30s would get a kick out of this game because it kind of brings you back to your roots a little bit, but with a modern day twist. And I think that, um, I think the demographic for this game is, is a lot wider than, than most. Yeah, I think if you're, like, <sighs> really that yeah, call back to me yawning a lot during this game. Um, if you're, like, the type that's playing Fortnite a lot or, call, like, Call of Duty or something, Maybe this isn't for you, but if you just want like a fun story with clearly a lot of care put into it and looks great, uh, yeah. And it's... if you're looking for a break from World War II because there's Cause nothing good about it. Look dude, if you're gonna, how about instead of playing Destiny? <laughs> how about instead of playing AAA titles that all suck?
I mean, yeah, I, with the way video games go, that's probably not like the worst, uh, that's not the worst <laughs> plan. I forgot we had to watch this whole scene too. Oh yeah, well now it's now it's supposed to be because it's supposed to be like a Saturday morning cartoon. Like here's the intro to the. That's intro. right. Yeah. God, I love this animation. I like. I just want to know how they did it. Did they do it all by hand? It has to be. That looks so cool. Crossing Souls. Dark Souls. <gasps> Crossing, it's like Dark Souls, but... Uh, they crossed. But easy. Cool. Alright. Well, so yeah, that's uh, Crossing Souls. Uh, coming out on the... Oh, no! Coming Spoiler out, alert. Coming coming out, out on the, on uh, the PS4. PC. I mean, it's already... I don't know why I was saying coming out. It's already out. Yeah, it is already out. And, Might uh, come to the Switch one day. Hopefully it comes to the Switch. It's also coming out for Sega Genesis. Hell yeah. Alright. All right. Thanks a lot. Bye everybody. Bye.